Virgo musicians, Kim Enchantress here. I hope you guys are well. I'm here to do your music reading for the 2nd of October 24. It is the eclipse, solar eclipse, rather, in Libra. And what it means for you guys in your music career is re-evaluating re and balancing uh, relationships. You know, maybe you guys are on a new music endeavour and you're starting to reap what you sowed. Okay, you planted all the seeds for something new. A fresh financial start is on the way. And no matter where you stand before this eclipse, definitely changes are coming in for you, Virgo. Now, some of you may receive news about a loan or a settlement through your music. Or you may have a current investment that may finally start to move in the right direction for you in this music career. Maybe writing songs for others. Who knows? Whatever the case may be for you. Now, issues of giving and receiving will also crop up. Um, if you're giving more than you get, or vice versa, a rebalancing is coming here with this eclipse. Now, before we move on to the Lenormand cards... There is unknown karmic patterns from past life that could be influencing and even blocking your deepest desires, <clears throat> blocking you from moving forward. So let's see what that was or what it is still at a current, uh, at present. Let's see. For a beautiful Virgo. So ripping what you sow is coming up for you guys. What is this? past issue that was blocking thank you Archangel Ragul so there was some sort of uh, discipline in a past life or past where justice took place now you're trying to balance those scales you got the angels behind you you know maybe you've been trying to move mountains but now is time to release whatever has been going on and um, you're moving forward. You're starting to see your crops grow in your music. You're moving in the right direction. So let's see what your angel messages are here. Oh, too many, sorry spirit, too many. You. Okay, we've got Athena. So it is safe for you, <coughs> excuse me, to be powerful. You know how to be powerful in a loving way that benefits others as well as yourself. So you're going to step back into your power, bring harmony to others, bring harmony to yourself. You're starting to see whatever endeavors you have moving forward. So let's take a look at what this justice, discipline and harmony is. So, you know, number 23 breaks down to a five. So there could have been, you know, slow growth here, having patience to see things moving forward. You're starting to see those branches sprout their leaves now. Yep, definitely um, stress of trying to um, achieve something, trying to accomplish something. Okay, and what else do we have, Spirit? Okay. okay. So now you've reflected and uh, you're becoming independent in a way here, Virgo. This is um, something independent that you're doing. You're starting to feel proud of your success. You're starting to see things sprout. You, you know, you're illuminating something and it's up high. You've got the key here. So spirit is intervening. You've got to pay attention to your boundaries and restrictions that you're putting up in front of you. Let those boundaries down. To a certain point, you don't have to let everyone in who's causing stress, but pay attention to those boundaries. Okay. Is there any more spirit? Thank you. 
Okay, so someone could be returning, it could be an ex of some kind or an ex uh, musician partner that you're going to cut off. Okay, they caused a lot of stress in the past where you had to um, have justice and find that harmony within your own self. Now, success is coming after a lot of confusion, misunderstandings. Um, you've been separated from this person for quite some time, maybe 12 months, but they're returning um, to try and harvest something with you because they can see that you're going to be successful. Let's see. You've got the Leo energy there. Let's see what your outcome is, please. And the only card that flew out was passion. Be loving, kind and gentle to others. You are nurturing others. You are bringing that balance and power back <clears throat> to yourself and to others. And you're very passionate about what you do. You're starting to harvest what you're passionate about. No more stress in that department for you. You know, uh, you're going to start implementing and reaping those rewards Okay, um, no more reflecting or being misunderstood by others. And Spirit is bringing someone into your life or a message of some kind um, that's going to help you along the way. But you're now ripping what you sow. So I'm sending you lots of love and uh, finally moving in the right direction, guys. Bye for now.